happens to be bent. Let's see if uh, one of my favorite games wants to play from here. Do it on my audio, so I'm sounding constantly through the microphone and stuff. So obviously I've played this uh played this game before. So we're gonna buy a new set for a stream because I think that'd be fun and I think it's a good series too and also because I just stream whatever I like at this point. I plan on doing Subnautica and um Doom again. Yeah. Just getting through college. Oh wow, look at that. I forget this thing has a light on it. There we go. Throw the nice light on it. Me oh my, the loading on this. Sisters and brothers of the fifth fleet, it's time. I'll keep my farewell brief. Never was much with words. Once you board this ship, there's no turning back. The next ground your feet will touch will be that of the new world. If any of you have lost your nerve, then step away now and let no one judge you. Very well. Then sail safe and strong. And may the Sapphire Star light your way. Stream info. There we are. There we go. Oops, I accidentally closed it. Almost there. You ready to grab this new world by the horns? Don't know about you. It feels like ages since I left home to join the commission. So nervous? Believe you me, I get it. Anything could happen to us, but hey, that's yep. happening. Uh. Hey, aren't you one of the A-list hunters? What? No way! So are we! Hey! Tell us your name. Brother, dude. Adjusting. Let's see what's happening here. See what we can do for the video capture and the display capture. See if I can limit them. Put them in. So we'll just go with what we can do. Just click that guy and start. Start from here. Face. We need the big fucking chin.
Crack baby special. I'm so pretty, I'm so pretty. is good. Chainmail is good. Guardian is literally starting to off way higher than what you should. So like if you get it with the ice board you see, you're gonna get it. It's really powerful. But you see, I'm no baby bitch boy. I just take one of these two starting with no armor is just kinda dumb. Which one though? Which one? You look sick. And then come on. My Twitch crashed. Subs. Yeah, good stuff. Bob <laughs> chicken lizards. Ball here. 
pour refroidir. Like high res versus low bath. Like make it thin, short, thick, and long. That's nice. That sounds like one of those little fucking tip tip things. I just realized I've been talking this entire time. Nothing has been heard. Because it's just like so much silence. It's like way too much thought. No, I'm just stupid. Look at all. He's just a little fella. Oh lord, he's adorable. And of course, the best thing that I've my look. What to name a cat? Those with the cloud of death. <laughs> to the A-list and the commission. Cheers. <laughs> so tell me, what's your theory? The elder dragons must migrate to the new world for some reason. running the research commission for 40 odd years, the guild's itching for an answer. They say the fifth fleet's got the best shot at crack in this case, and I agree. Keep it down. Hey, speaking of, A-listers usually operate in teams of two. Have you sat down with your partner yet? Listen to that. <sighs> Getting rough out there. The waves are picking up. That's gotta mean landfall. <laughs> You're on the A-list, right? Huh. Meow-dee-doo. 
<laughs> I'm not psychic, but I do have pretty good ears. Ah, put her there. I happen to be an A-lister myself. Oh, whoa! <laughs> <laughs>
or uh, new footage, then upload it uh, to YouTube because I haven't done that in like four months. Because you know, I do enjoy streaming and stable the world. Tent. It has a map in it. Well, point, part of one at least. Meh. All right. So, there's the ancient forest. Looks like we're right around here. Or uh, right now. We gotta get over here. The research commission's base of operations is here. This is where our ship was supposed to dock. For now, I think it would be best if we make our way to base. The map should help us find our way. There. I kind of wish it was. It looks really beautiful. Like, most of this game looks absolutely gorgeous. You know? Like, Look, big old the tree. research commission's headquarters. Come on, let's get going. Tree branch here. <laughs> According to the map, uh, to get to HQ, we need to. Hmm. There, uh, I had the scout flies memorize my scent push. earlier. If you lose sight of me, just follow the scout flies, and they'll lead you right to me. Well, we still can. Hmm. Like I said, this game is Nothing can stop us. <laughs> Climb down here. There's also a cave there. No idea what this random swinging tendril is for. Never could figure that out. Oh, <laughs> oh, that I didn't know I could even get those right now. What is this track? Oh, skid marks. Look! There's more over there. Let's check it out. Oh, you know what the track is? Oh, I remember. I forgot about the little bit of dialogue.
Hey. You all right? Let's go. Okay. Just one type of uh tree, and I don't want to make it easy, so I'm just gonna avoid the defender trees. Like I'll make the weapons because I'm a completionist, and having all the weapons sounds like it's fun. Also, I'm realizing just how high up this is. Wow! You know, the more I think about it, the more I realize. Amazing, ain't it? Just look at this gate. It's like nature meant for us to build a stara right here. Stara, I like it. The rest of the fifth are already here. You're the last to arrive. Okay, set him down here. Take it nice. You need to take off your shoulder. Hold still for a bit. Hey, you guys made it. Be right back. You're alive. Had a rough, huh? When we couldn't find you two, we were starting to sweat bullets. You scared us. We were talking about going out to look for you. <laughs> All's well that ends well. Hey, we need a hand. Sorry. Come on. Catch you later. <laughs> <laughs> this here's our trade yard. I guess the name says it all. Look at all the people. The stuff. Incredible. Right? We've got it all here. We've got hunters to do all the exploring. Scholars to do the research. Technicians to keep them going. This place is the beating heart of the commission. Wait here a second. Commander, I found him. Welcome to Astera. Your reputations precede you. Well, off you go. Okay, I'll give you the grand tour. Let's start by looking for your palico. This is our stockpile. They carry most of the basic necessities. You should drop by later to see what they have. Next is the smithy. It's this way. Over here. Hmm. You were the commission's fifth fleet, right? The old man in charge, my grandfather, was with the first. That was a long time ago. Me? Not with any fleet. Born and bred right here. Never even been to the old world. Here's our smithy. This is where you can craft weapons and armor. You'll be here a lot. Wow! Look at this place. Wanna check it out? Toasty in here. Wanna get going? The canteen? Oh, I am so there. Hmm. Everything. Here. This here's our canteen.
Right. I'm calling for a counter myself. Come on. Yeah. Now that you are all here, let us begin council. No, it's picking up my voice, so I'm not. After tracking a migrating elder, the Fifth Fleet have finally arrived. They're a fine group. Worthy comrades who will help see the Research Commission's long efforts finally rewarded. Would you like to say a few words? Thank you, sir. We're ready to roll up our sleeves. This here is the Commission's core team. You should all get to know each other. Looking forward to it. Here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna bring this down to about 50%. So that we can get this going. We're gonna double check the microphones. Because I know the microphones do work. The properties, drilling mic, we're even gonna go to that audio for the camera. Back to this microphone here. And that should help with my auditory now, the problems. Monster to make the research commission's job is to discover exactly why the elder dragons are migrating to the new world. Worst case scenario, if this one just falls through, I can just restart stream and put audio dubbing, or even just restart. We're on it. Everyone else, go from the get go again. Make sure these hunters have everything they need. Now we're talking. There's a second complete master. He's you in the two. armory. Make it a prior. You heard him. <laughs> Stick with the fifth banner. Promises a change in the wind. It's your. All right. Dismissed. Dismissed. Uh, mm -hmm. Over here. Here's my quarters. I've been trying to figure out like why won't my thing play more like music and stuff, or not music, my uh, my microphone. And I can tell when I open up my thing that I can see like my auditory system, and I can adjust it in real time. Like I can adjust camera sure placement and things like that. Suits. Alright, let's see what we get. Oh, I already know what we get. So. We got all of these. These are all metal. Metal. So I'm, um, I want to see if this, like, works. Waiting to see if the audio works. There we go, there we go. Okay, so I just wanted to make sure that that audio was working now. So, we're gonna run through all of these, of course, and then I'll even show the difference between the mole drone here and the coal drone with this weapon, it's called the Iron Blade. I'll show more later. So we're just gonna go through all the weapons and just show them all as much as I can. Starting with the big heavy guy, the Buster Sword. Wanna get going? So. Handlers sort through the research commission's leads. And the ones they deem worth our attention become quests. 
There's a lot of people to talk to. I really ought to. Hey. So, Over here. Let's yeah, talk to him. Now that's hunting. What this world needs is harmony. So, he is just essentially talking about like clearing up <laughs> monsters, weapons, supplies. This guy is essentially explaining that what he sells, most of what he sells right now is just simple stuff, along with ammo, a boomerang, you know, binoculars, and you can see it from far away, other tools, like actual trap tools, and stuff. He's got some real good stuff, and we'll be seeing more of that later. <coughs> Ups. <laughs> so this lady in here, she sells like the basic stuff if I don't want to make it, but it's easy to get all the gear. So, I can purchase weapons, obviously, it's gonna be the really easy Buster Bone Blade. Alright. Or, like, the difference between those. Defender gear. Whole set, 251, right off the bat. Way too crazy. And, and look at this. Look at this. Recovery, Marathon Runner, Health Boost, Divine Blessing, Master Gatherer. Like, it's a really OP armor set. And then you can even further upgrade it, and it's just so that you can immediately compare to other things. Here's all of this. Like, even if I wanted to, I can't sell it. I can change my equipment, though. And I'll show you some other things. Oh, oh. Guess I gotta finish talking to Handler first and finish the uh, quest that it's given me. So I'll show you kind of what this weapon can do by just going here, going to Hunter Notes, and going to Weapon Controls. So this one is a great sword. It's a real slow, you know, real slow, like, ding. You got useful combos though, which is cool. Right, so you can uh, combo into slashes and stuff like that. We'll start with this. So overhead, wide, rising tackle, guard, your slinger, and that. But all of your stuff right here is going to be mostly this. There's going to be these five right here. Then you have your slinger burst, which lets you like grab on and shoot stuff. Oh, actually, hold on. Nope, Slinger Burst is a different thing. So this is just emptying, essentially, all of my ammo into the monster. <laughs> so after a weak point, the second attack will do much more damage. And that'll be something I'll do later. Then you got your combos. Which is, you know, it's cool. So we're gonna talk to her and we're gonna get going. Oh, yeah. First things first, hunt in a couple of chakras. Next, exit, assign, chakras to the ancient forest, and we're just gonna, you know, fight the monster. So there's not really too much we gotta do, so we're just gonna wait. We don't have money, we don't have stuff, so we can't get too much for the daily stuff. Quest rules. Rule number one, complete the objective to complete the quest. Easy, right? 
Each quest has an objective. You can't consider the quest done until you could. Our current objective is to eliminate a specified number of Jagras. Let's check the map. We ran into some Jagras on the way to base. The small monsters, remember? I think we saw them somewhere around here. Yeah. Want to check it out? Rule number two. You the commission supplies us with a they're in the supply box over there. Have a look and decide what you should take along. Oops. Didn't mean to do that. Oh yeah. So rations are always good and first aid man. Hey partner. Wanna get going? Uh-huh. Grab her herbs. Raw meat we can use to cook. Be use some rations too. We're gonna go to the easy rations. Like this. I'm just gonna munch on these because they're provided and ready your weapon before it's gone at the end of the Keep in mind anyway. that what you're able to do depends on whether or not your weapon is drawn. When you're investigating or gathering items, you'll generally want to keep your weapon sheathed. You can Always gather honey and mix it with a potion to make mega potions. potions I'll mark mega gathering potions. sites and monster positions on the wildlife map for you. Over so here. we're going in here. A pack of Jagras! Those are the monsters we're after! Let's see how you hold up when you're on your own. As you can see, this weapon is very slow, so it's slow to hit, but I can also do that. They're on the run. Don't let them get away. attacks and stuff. Grab all the monsters we will let them get away because they're just going into the hole. Missing. So we're going to grab some extra scales and some things that are around this little area here. Like these parish rooms up here, which are going to be good. See what's over here. Not really too much. Ooh, another set of parish rooms. We don't have a need to explore. Some slinger ammo. Bone piles. This will be important for a little bit when we start making bone weapons. This <laughs> is good to have one of each. And then of course you want to have these mining outcrops as well. Depending on what you get for a battle too. You can also get some really interesting things. Oops. Boop. Okay, blind it by the light. Use whatever you can. You can use the slinger with your weapon drawn. Look for the perfect moment, then fire. Oh, that was cool. I forgot I could do that. So, like right now, these weapons are really weak. The attacks leave you wide open. The payoff is well worth it. Good thing about this weapon: easy crowd control. Bad thing about the weapon: really slow. Side note: also good for completely just bashing on lizards. So we're going to clear out the rest of these Jagras, you know, just kind of sneak by them because they aren't going to fuck with us right now, especially with that right there. And that allows me to get to these bones back here. That's really the only bone pile. Here I have another flash. So like I said, really slow weapon. I forgot I could do that. You can kick and then into a tackle. Which is great. And then you can... Yeah, this weapon's like, it's slow, it's got movement options though. So it's got ways to be better. It's just I'm bad with this weapon. And look at all these bitter bugs, malachite. Monster bones, armor spheres. Those are all going to be useful later. We've got about 15 minutes. So 
So we're gonna let this continue. <laughs> Good to see you. So there's that. Talking a lot. Listen up. On Magna Ross. Right. I can also do online sections, right. which will give me now that you've got some materials, stuff. Why don't we head over to the Smithy to see what you can do with them? A lot of extra stuff. Snow fight, of course. Do have a snow fight during free time? What other places know a snow fighters begin? Do have fun? Don't start a snow fight without proper warning. Don't throw snowballs. And hunters doing quests. Like, oh, yeah, that makes sense. Yes, I too wish to just vibe check some dude fighting an absolutely horrifying Hello. monster. So, Gathering Hub is <laughs> its top layer. We aren't going up there, though. We're just going up here. Talking to this fella right back here. Greetings. All right. First things first. Let's manage items. Put in the extra these and the herbs. Go in there for now. And in the meantime, we'll also change the equipment from that to that. <sighs> and there we go. There now we have the favorite. next one. Mm. So, we're gonna upgrade. And I like to sort it by tree, so it organizes it for me. So, we have all of these that we have access to. So we just used the Buster Sword, and since it wants us to do an upgrade, we'll, we'll do it on the next weapon we're using. The Iron Katana here. It'll play a little movie, or I can skip it, I'll let you guys see it for this time. Iron Katana 2. And right now we only have up to 4 here, so real nice, real simple. And we'll upgrade this too because that's going to be something we're getting later. We're going to be using that later. And we'll just slowly make our way down the list until we decide to choose one. Yeah, it wants us to do... We'll go here. We'll go to Great Sword first. Oh, hold on. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So we can get half of the weapons already. So we're gonna do that. Do we have enough? We do have enough. So we're gonna get half the bone weapons already. Bone chattel. Sword and shield. We got bone kukri. Lots of different uh, references to like actual weapons too. Hatchets, like these flat blades are reference, but like kukri being an actual weapon. <laughs> of course, you know you have these obscenely large hammers too. And this is also just a good way to show you guys what all I have access to. Horn. I'm a musical man. This one's really good for like when you're playing with other people. And I'll show that more later when I get to it. Bone lance, of course, it's just like an obscenely large version of a regular lance. And then I'll show the rest of that later. We'll go to armor real quick and just see what we can do. So we have these two. 
Leather is the better of the two if you want to go against fire. That's good to know. First things first, Hunter, which is a mix of both. Which has more health, and then it's got both the advantages. And you got Bone, which frankly just looks sick. And this is the current event one right now, O'Brien. Oh, and look at him, he's wearing a snow cap, he's Santa Claus. And then of course you have these pendants. They go on your weapon. Palico equipment, so with these you can go through and you can give him new stuff. So he's right now looking at 79, 4 for fire, so if I put him bone, he gets upgraded. Alloy he loses all advantages, but he gets more range damage. So I don't see why you'd do this if you could do this and get all of that instead of going all the way down to negative 4. Or you have the new snow set with it. Oh my god, that's adorable. He's got a little bell. And it it's powerful. So, bow guns. Bow guns have mods on them. So these bow guns right now have two mods. I can put on... Looks like I can put on one mod right now. And we're gonna put on... Put on. Let's see. So this one has Waver and Blast, which is a fun one. Waver and Blast counter. So we're we're gonna put that on. And this one has Waver and Heart. So that just... That allows me to manage that later. So. Another thing. Kinesex. These are for Insect Glaives. You get two. They have two trees here. And they just, they just keep going. So you got Coldron and Moldron. They're essentially your bone and steel trees. And then of course you can purchase them. Um, So we'll go on one more quest, um, then I think we'll be done for today. I'll talk to this guy up here too. Look at him, he's a big boy. Gourmet Shroom Caps. <laughs> that's a new quest too. Quest board, of course. Too. It lists the same quest that I've got, so don't worry about having to two places. That's really nice, having only need we're to talk to hunt. one person. So we're gonna post a new quest, and then we're gonna wander down to talk to whoever needs to be talked to. We don't want to use lucky vouchers because we don't care. Like, I just refuse to use the Lucky Vault uh, vouchers for anything, unless, like, it's a major boss fight. And I know that if I win, I'm getting some boss rewards. I'll be here. So, this is the research fella. Essentially, talk to him. I can get info, more info for like I said before, although it might not have been heard, okay. love this game, love Doom, Monica, all the other ones will just be, you know, repeated later. Wanna get going? My friend, are tested on. Let's see you take so it on your This own. has huh. two separate bars that you can do. Be careful. So 
so now I've built up that. Can go. Oh. Okay. God damn it. I don't understand how this one works at all, obviously. I don't have an issue with it. So we're gonna heal back up. We're gonna look at what we can do here. It might help us. Actually, you know what? Why not just. There we go. figuring it out Not rather bad. quickly. And that charges up the second form of bar. So I would put that away for now. And that charge actually like stays on the thing from what right. it seems. Let's look for another group. Be so careful. Gonna clip this. The and now we have an understanding of what the hell this thing does. This it's a vitality. This heals us. Try to learn as much as you can about them. Doesn't really matter because we're already healed. Looks like the Apsaros isn't happy. Needleberries are for ammo later. I think over here there's a couple of these. Oh, hey, look, herbs. Oh, let my character breathe a little. Get some ammo. Or some iron over ore. Here. No other stuff over here, right? So we run up here. Huh. And down here. Be careful. Obviously, you can see most weapons you're going to be able to figure out rather quickly. Oh, that's another thing that I should state. So if you look at like when I'm doing things, how sometimes my weapon will bounce off like their heads. That's because if you look at this bar right below my little stamina bar, that's the, that's the yellow one. I am losing stamina, or losing uh, weapon sharpness. So you just take up this little whetstone, infinite use. Helps if you're also in a safe spot. No idea. I'll just, I'll just continue slicing the casket on. Another thing, don't be an idiot. Good work. That just about wraps up our work here. Wait. Hey, come here. I think I found something. I'll just take off the Kestodon shells because I need those. Don't be dumb when you play the game. I'm just being dumb because I can. If you take unnecessary risks, you will find out. Looks Here. like Dagger's Footprints. Look at 
those Kestadon. Something's up with them. <laughs> He's a bit hungry. Now, now. Gotcha. All right, partner. New assignment incoming. Take down that great Jagras. If so you're not ready, we're gonna you can return to base and take back the over here, and we're gonna switch up the weapon so we can finish this up. So you can actually switch the weapon at any time in the field. You call your friends for help. Go to the menu. So you have like a weapon SOS that's to signal it. essentially like a little cheat, to better track a target like the defender weapons. Which if I'm like grinding materials, maybe I'll use them. Because they make grinding a lot easier, but I won't use them to go against a boss for like the first time, unless I do it on accident. Other than that, I don't try to. So this is a sword and shield, as you can see, sword and shield. Let's see what, we're, what are we looking at for time? We're still looking at pretty good time. So once I finish this quest, we'll continue. Find me some. Oh, he looks kind of nuts. Yeah, time to show you guys what this thing does. So this is a very fast, speedy kind of weapon. Really good. There we go. We got this stuff off the Jagras, because we can just hold on to it or even sell it. His money. Grab this stuff from over here. Ooh, light crystal. So is the great dragon hiding down here? Nope. Bomb pile. You can just kind of ignore them too. Bye. <laughs> so we're not over here. We're gonna see what we can get. Uh, almost a thing. Oh no! I forgot to grab. Them. Oops. So now we hunt down Jagger's footprints. Eat a ration. Eat two rations. Go to my mega potions and just hold on to these. Footprint. Hit marks. Grab those. Get these. Good. You're turning up a lot of clues. Another well, small area I kind of forget exists. Because it's just kind of tucked underneath. As I said before, this game is fucking beautiful. So, sometimes it's good to just do things. <coughs> and there's our lizard boy. Okay, we've tracked the great Jagras enough for the scout flies to lead us to it. You're less likely to lose sight of a monster if you use the focus case. Sword and shield is a close range weapon set that focuses on agility and dodge. And it's great for beginners. Look out! Your health is low. Keep your distance and use a potion. We don't really have 
too much for uh, defense, so whenever we get hit, we are definitely gonna feel it. Dodge their attacks. Don't forget you can guard too. Your weapon is losing its sharpness. Create some distance, then use a whetstone. And as you can see right there, these shields are fucking beefy. Sometimes they hit you with that combo breaker though. And of course, you know, we have bigger wasps ready and I'll show how to get all of those. Uh, Alico equipment is what they're called. In the, in the I'll show you how to get most everything. This is like the only one as well that you can use your items with while battling, so I don't need to stop moving to get my uh to my potion i can just guard and then i can use my potion oops i did not mean to do that luckily it's really easy to get more so hooray like so crafting list use two more potions for myself oh crafting list i'm gonna start crafting some of these having those is really useful. These herbal medicines, real great because they restore a little bit of health with your poison and that'll come up later with some monsters I end up having some choice words for. Slinger torch, yeah. Bitter bug, did I grab it? I did, okay good. Colony, pull the shroom. And that'll come up later as well when I do a different quest. Yeah, I'll probably end up playing this. He also does that, which okay. is kind of weird. Monsters trapped in the vines. Now hit it with all you got. Good for distance though. So, you know. He's gonna start running now. Oh, I guess not this time. Right, so what we really were trying to grab here was on the floor. That path right there. Grab. So these, I'll get three drops each. Every time you kill a big one. I 
Like I said, I'm not real great at this. So, you know, my screen name is also an ironic pun. Sure, Linux. My screen name is the cop death, and all I do is die. Get all the stuff off of these. There we go, we got it all. Look at that. And that was sword and shield, and... I forgot how fun that weapon was, honestly. The ability to do massive damage and also guard is really good because it's doing 25 30 damage at a shot so it's doing the same damage as that long sword oh hey feathers i think we got a lead hmm. maybe mm -hmm. let's check it out Lizard. Bird. This thing's honestly just a con. Well, you were right. There's our mark. Well, it'll be, you know, depending on how you feel about that one. If this thing just spits poison, it's essentially like Something's a. Uh, oh. Yeah, that would have me pissed off too if somebody left a smoldering rock on my floor. There. Is that? I've never seen anything like it. You think it's from Zora Magdaros? I'd like to find out. But we better report back first. All right? So, yeah. I'll show you how one grinds parts for monsters in this. It's real great for grinding high level monsters when you bring the the most angry, painful stuff along. So we're gonna just clear up. The first level for Great Jagras. An achievement. I see. Uh huh. Wanna get going? <sighs> Once the camp is set up, you can go after that Puke Puke. Yeah, it's a Puke Puke. I wonder where the resource center is. So we're not really going to do anything interesting with uh, the Puke Puke. There you are, Piper. Now I can do Stay layered tall. armor, which I don't really care about. Like, it's just... It's just this. It's just on top. Point of deal doesn't really do too much. Now we can do Kestadon gear, which is just these little gauntlets. Which is, you know, an upgrade. Or we can do Jagras, which gives me the most, but it gives me minus five for fire, thunder, and ice. So I don't know why I'd do that one instead of doing Hunter or Bone. Cause like 10 more damage versus 30 resistance flat out. So let's see. Oh, I'm missing one inch of bone. So we're already gonna put one inch of bone into this and upgrade to some bone gear. Leggies are cold. This is what we're gonna do before we end the stream. We're just gonna get some upgrades. Looks like I need three ancient bones. Which is fine, you know. I'll be getting the rest of that later. Uh, we'll go to upgrade equipment. So, next one match slicers. Equip now. We will equip that now. We're gonna need to get more iron. And actually, we're even going to do this, too, on top of that. To 
the sword. So we can upgrade like the bone weapons and stuff. So forge equipment. Gun lance. Bone gun lance. Maybe we'll see more of that later. Switch axe. You'll definitely see that one later because I love this weapon. Switch X. Also love this weapon. And that is you know uh, Switch X Shrine's blade. So only four more bone weapons to grab before I have one for each major tree. We're gonna sort real quick by tree. Yes. So, uh, in the wise, wise, wise words of me, myself, and I, thank you for coming and watching. If you did, if you're seeing this on YouTube or seeing this live on Twitch, just thanks for watching. Thank you for letting me share what I do and not hating on me for it. Uh, yeah, you guys have a good day, and I'll see you guys maybe later. How we did? Huh, we did all my outro stuff, and I'm still just sitting here. Look at me. I'm a sad man. Adios, y'all.